622 on WBOC News this morning. You're taking a live look in Melfa, Virginia, and Accomack County, where a fire that had started prior in the night has reignited, and firefighters have responded back to the scene. There were two fires reported overnight in Accomack County, one here in Melfa, another one in Quimby, but they have not confirmed that those two fires were arsons, along with the 46 others that have been reported so far in Accomack County. Well, fire crews in Accomack County had two more late night fires to respond to. This brings the number of fires in Accomack County to nearly 50 in only four months. The number of confirmed arsons standing at 46. One was at an abandoned structure fire in Quimby when crews put it out a little before 11 last night. The other fire was at the intersection of Rose Cottage and Fair Oaks Roads in Melfa. Fire crews say that burn lasted until 1130. WBOC's Cleo Green joins us live via satellite from Melfa. And Cleo, that fire that we just mentioned has actually reignited right behind you. At Lacey, we're here on Rose Cottage Road, and we have been monitoring the fire this morning out here since about 3 o'clock. Now, firefighters did say they contained the fire around 1130, but we have seen smoldering, a few uh, small lit fires here. So we called the Melfa Fire Department, as you can see, two firefighters on scene now. Uh, making sure that the fire here is contained, putting out those small lit fires. Now, Virginia State Police cannot uh, confirm if this fire and the other one from last night are arsons until they're properly investigated. But authorities do want to remind the public that a reward for up to $5,000 is being offered for information that leads to the arrest and conviction of the arsonists at work here in Accomack County. Now, the locations of the arsons have ranged from Melfa to Parksley to Oak Hall. Authorities say the fires target abandoned structures like vacated houses, abandoned farms, and even chicken coops. Now, the fires have been set anytime between 8.30 p.m. to 4 a.m., and police say no injuries or deaths have resulted from the fires. We spoke to one only assistant fire chief who tells us they've been stretched thin. As we've been challenged night after night, the fire service has really gelled together and the teamwork that's being displayed by these men and women is very professional. And once again, as you can see here, uh, two firefighters from the Melfa Fire Department are putting out and making sure this fire is contained here on Rose Cottage Road. And this was a vacant uh, cabin-sized home here. Jimmy, Lacey? So, Cleo, uh, heads up thinking there on calling them back out after this fire where you are reignited while you were reporting this morning. Now, the other fire was just a few mm -hmm. miles away. Just about seven miles away in Quimby, Virginia. Once again, Virginia police, uh, Virginia State Police cannot confirm if these two separate fires are the work of an arsonist or arsonist until they investigate this properly. Reporting live here in Melfa, Cleo Green, WBOC News.